check out these six growth stocks you might want to consider. What's up YouTube? I'm Chris Sane. If you're new to the channel, I make videos about personal finance, how to invest and build wealth through the stock market. I started the Robinhood Challenge for two reasons. Number one, I wanted to show people that wanted to invest but didn't quite know how to. And number two, I wanted to show you the companies I invest in to go from $0 to 10 k and then eventually from 10 k to 100 k you can join a journey by grabbing some free stock using my link below or feel free to sit back and just watch. Either way, I appreciate you. Today's video is about six growth stocks I want you to consider. Some I own, some I don't. Regardless, I want to show you firsthand so you can make a decision for yourself and choose whether or not you want to add these to your portfolio. Let's get started. So as you can see, my portfolio is currently at $9,165.49. Before we jump into the growth stocks, how about we open two stocks on the day to see what we get? Feeling lucky, so I'm gonna go with this one right here. Washington Prime Group. And here it is, we got one share for $3.36. The next one, I'm gonna go in the middle this time. And this one is GoPro. And GoPro is one share for $4.44. So every video I'll try to open up some of the free stock I get just so you can see <clears throat> what I'm getting as well. But regardless, here we go. The number one growth stock that I want to look at is Facebook. As you can see, it's currently trading for $217.50. I actually own two shares of Facebook. My average cost is $221.08. I like this company because I feel they are gonna crush it in the future, they are gonna crush it this year they're going to crush it in the next five years and so these is this is one of my favorites in terms of a growth stock that i'm riding rocking with for the long haul and so i'm big on the things um that mark zuckerberg is doing i think between facebook and instagram he's really taken over the market and um, advertisers can get the best bang for their buck using either of those platforms my number two stock is um, Netflix. And so, let me see, I can't even get, oh, I'm spelling it wrong, Netflix. Now this stock I don't own, but as you can see, it's currently trading for $351.43. Netflix to me has done a good job of holding their own despite Disney and other companies jumping into the streaming space. But also they have a great uh, subscriber base already that they can build and grow from. And I, I think they do a good job at creating original series. Every time I'm online at least, I see people talking about um, a series or a show that they like on Netflix. And so when you can hear people still talking about something and they happen to be a company that's solid across the board, I consider personally Netflix to be a good growth stock that you might want to consider. The next one is Beyond Meat. This one currently is at $119.35 after hours. I don't own this one, but I can't help but to acknowledge, especially as a fitness guy myself, um, the vegan movement, the health movement, and people moving away or at least having an alternative to go to such as um, what Beyond Meat is trying to corner the market with. And so I think some big partnerships like with McDonald's, um, I think they just got in with Starbucks, different things like that will keep giving them a chance to kind of break through but right now between the support, some of the higher, higher profile peoples I see investing in this company, this may be something you might wanna consider. Next, we have, um, I'm big on, if you know me, 
I'm big on Tesla. Tesla's been crushing it. Everybody that's uh, not under a rock that keeps up with dividend investing, growth stocks investing, all of that, you see what Tesla's been able to do. Um, I'm a huge fan of the company. I'm a huge fan of Elon Musk. And again, they're currently going for $559.01. Uh, I own one share of this company personally, and my average cost is $508. Of course, I got some money sitting on the sideline because I'm gonna increase my position in this company because I, I see them uh, just taking over and doing really, really well. Uh, they got an earnings call coming up that regardless um, if they meet numbers or not, Tesla is uh, something I'm riding with for the long haul. So what we got, Facebook, Tesla, Netflix, Beyond Meat. So I got two more. Uh, that I want you guys to look at and my, my fifth one is My fifth one is AMD I can't help but to tell you guys about AMD, but I got to be transparent. I remember um, When this company was three dollars this current this this company is currently fifty dollars and thirty two cent If you look here, I own five shares and my average cost is fifty dollars and ninety six cent I missed out on a great company that had great potential, but I can still see them going up from here. When you hit the $50 mark in the stock market, that's a milestone that you wanna keep an eye on because they have the potential to go higher. And so AMD, I'm all in on AMD. I established a small share of UC5 stocks, of five shares, um, I established a small position because I wanna um, at least keep a closer eye on this stock and see what it's going to do as it competes with Intel and, and other semiconductors in the uh, chip space. And um, I'm, I'm banking on AMD to really be a major player moving forward uh, as they already been, but I see potential moving forward. And so that's another great growth stock for you to consider. My final growth stock for you to consider is Shopify. Now, Shopify is currently $465.48. Um, if you are in the e-commerce space, you already know that they have been crushing it. They got a little bit of competition from some other sites, but to me, nobody is more prevalent and prominent than Shopify. Um, the company uh, is well ran and again it's something that you might want to consider if you want some growth stocks to add to your overall portfolio to help build your wealth okay that's it for today but listen i make videos like this every week so if you like this one make sure you check out the next one and remember most people see the end result very few consider the journey do me a favor don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel make sure you grab some free stock using my link below and I'll see you in the next one.